I'm Pat Shand. I'm Amy Shand. And we are Space Between. We're here today to react to um, a video that perhaps some of our viewers might find controversial. Oh. We have uh, reacted mostly to rappers who you would say um, are lyrical. It's some rapid oh, rap shit. Oh, I see who it is. They have bars. Uh, this person... They have a little bit more uh, street cred, if you will. Yes. Much more than this person. Um... We're going to react today to the new song by Bad Baby. And it's featuring Tory Lanez. Who's a real established artist. Yeah. Um, the song is called Baby Face Savage. Ooh. So here's, here's the truth. Um, do I think that Bad Baby is ever going to be an amazing artist? No. Not like a legend. Right. Do I think that she's made music that has made my head nod? And is more listenable than it has any right to be, even though it kind of makes me feel a little bit soulless. Real quick, though. Yes. Who is Bad Baby, for people who don't know? Oh, for sure. Bad it's <laughs> Danielle Brigoli. Wow. I, I didn't know that, her, her full name. Where is it? Oh, she, the, she, she's written in the description. Okay. <laughs> the Cash Me Outside girl. Yes. I don't follow her enough to know her full name. I oh, would have no. known her as the Cash Me Outside girl. No, no. I mean, I... From Dr. Phil? Dr. Phil, yeah. yeah. I, I know her from her video, um... um Gucci flip flops, fucking thing, da da ba da 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 ba da da ba 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 da da But yeah. her first fame was her... Oh, yeah. Her Dr. Phil uh, stint. Absolutely. She did the thing where she kind of, like, became a meme. Yes. And she just rolled with it. And now she's a rap artist. Yeah, and in fact, we were just talking now um, on our podcast about people who become memes and embrace it. Mm -hmm. And that's very much her. Though um, I feel that like she took her memedom and she's using it to become sort of who she wants to be and do what she wants to do. It's pretty cool she's so young to be doing this. Tory Lanez, she's young, man. Yeah. You're not. But, all right. I wonder, yeah, what the paycheck was for this, you know? Definitely. Let's hear the song. Anyway. Oh, wow. She looks different. Is that, is that, is that, is that, is that. Hilarious to me. Coming out hard like 88. Make a bitch never take baby face. Son, bitch, I don't play petty cake. Charms in the carrot cake. Carrots in the petty face. Top of new poop, no top. This is Kelly Way. Drop a little check, everybody lit. She has the hairdresser nails, you know? You cannot dress hair with those. I don't know, for some reason, I picture, like, someone working at the front desk at a hair salon just typing with super long, like, bluff yeah. replicas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those nails, they're just, like, curved. So long. And... I kind of understand what she's saying. She she sounds similar. T she doesn't sound like s not a rap artist. Like no, I think she sounds fine too. You know, um, she's not great, but yeah. she's not horrible. If this song came on on the radio on the club, between a song by, for instance, like Migos, yeah. and Lil Uzi Vert, you wouldn't bat an eye. I wouldn't be for like, sure. I wouldn't be like, who is this? No, I wouldn't think that. Not at all. Just a female. Absolutely. Artist. I like the mask too with the lights. That's cool. Her flow is at least as good as the Migos. <laughs> <laughs> and the Migos aren't bad With either. The top. That's yeah, she's a uh... Her hair is so long. That's just like the red ponytail? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she um I mean I'm sure that we're going to get some negative reactions from this, but is she uh she's better than she has any right to be. She's better than you would expect <clears throat> for sure, right? It's just interesting where she came from when Def you when you know. Definitely. I see her as someone who, if she keeps doing this, she will in the future be known more for this than how she's known from Catch Me Outside. She already looks and acts 
and even has like a lower voice I feel than when she was on Dr. Phil like oh for sure you know what I mean you can tell that she's being like groomed to, to be a star yeah I'm trying to make a latte with those. I'm done. Oh, God. I like the lights and colors of the video. It's a cool video. It's like neon. It's... It's very, like, gangster. You know, you're, um, you're apt to point out that asking if she is signed to a label. Because this video is clearly produced very well. Yeah. It's, it, there, there's money it's in It's like this. an expensive video. It looks yeah. like because of the different effects and the lights and stuff. Yes. She's for for sure being groomed to be a star. The uh, faces that are there kind of remind me... Um, do you remember uh, we were listening to uh, the songs from like the uh, Quadeca and KSI beef? Mm -hmm. In Quadeca's video, Insecure, he um, has bits like this where he draws like evil eyes on things. But this is super, super visual though. Like they're taking it to the next level as far as that goes. It reminds me of like the X's reminds me and the Smiley reminds me of Blink-182 meets like those, the Purge. Yo, Exactly. Um, the Blink-182 self-titled album. Yeah. That, that had Missy on there. Mm -hmm. For sure. For sure. Oh, it's toys coming in. I like that part. The bitch, 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 mm, yeah. bitch. I, I have I have quite a take right now. What is it? So far, thinking her part's better already. Really? I do. I do. You think he's trying to go too fast? I don't know. I I don't know. She's. I, I feel like Tory Lanez. You expect to be the superior artist because mm -hmm. he's like a known guy, mm -hmm. but her, you definitely expect less from her than she delivered. I, I think. So, uh, yeah, maybe I'm just, my expectations were, like, kind of slanted down a bit toward her just because she, she still is the Catch Me Outside girl, you know? And Tory Lanez, I only know him as an artist, right? Um, but, yeah, no, she, uh, let's see how it works out. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Too? That's the one I was singing. Oh, <laughs> I don't know that much. Um, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. That one I kind of f with the uh, Gucci flip flops. Okay. Th this one wasn't bad either. That wasn't bad. Um, I'm not going to go back and listen to it a bunch. Mm, she's no Cardi B or anything. No, she's no Cardi B or Nicki. But um, she's not the worst. For old school fans, she's no Lady of Rage. I feel like if you're being honest about it and you know where she came from and you watch that, it's hard to say that you're not impressed, you know? Yeah. And I feel like a lot of people hate her as a person. Oh, yeah. So they don't even give, like, this sort of, like, side of her a chance. But I agree. also, I feel like she, as a person, I know her as much as everyone else who hates her and doesn't know her. I feel like she's one to put on, like, a show. So on the Dr. Phil show, I feel like she was just right. going off 
I feel like right now she's going off, you know, like she's just, she likes to be over the top. And I feel like she was in a different character on the show even. I feel like, but I don't know. I don't know her. So when I watch stuff like this, I try to like forget that, you know, I haven't seen that video in years and I don't know much about her. So I just watch the video for what it is and it's not the worst video I've ever seen. No, not at all. So yeah, I I think that I would dance to it in a club. Oh, for sure. Yeah. I would sit back in the wall and watch you dance in the club. Definitely you would. I would. Deck and attack. I can see her <laughs> I can see her growing up through this too, you know. I um she's already working with people who you would say are real artists, mm-hmm. which I think that she's a real artist too. I, I think that um She's working to be because this video is not like a low quality, low budget video at least. She's like has a team around her that is professional in this uh, business it seems like. Definitely. And I mean, what you said is perfect because you say watching this, you don't think about where she came from. Mm -hmm. And I do think that if she keeps making content at this level, that uh, she's going to be someone that people no longer say they're surprised that she's working with a real artist. Because I think that if she stays doing things like this, she's going to be known for this rather than the the Because the other one was a really short video and now she has more than one music video and stuff and has her... She's like building another persona. Absolutely. So. So yeah. Um, whatever, good for her. I'm impressed. Yeah. I'm impressed. Um, and yeah, I do think that her part was better than Tori's part. Mm-hmm. But yeah, if you like this video, hit like. If you want to join our journey, hit subscribe. If you are a hundred percent not fucking with us at all, keep it a hundred percent honest, and hit the dislike. That's okay. You can dislike yes. it and keep it moving. We still love you. That's right. A little bit. Um, but, yeah, our uh, our podcast goes live on Tuesday. Our vlog goes up Thursday. Rest of the week, we post anything that we want to. Reaction videos. Fast food reviews. Who knows? Anything could happen. I want to do unboxing videos, too, eventually. Oh, for sure, unboxing videos. A- Amy's big on toys. Word. Subscribe. Subscribe.